The first period bell rang this morning for Wheeling Central's 2023 students, and not even the first day of school nerves could hide the optimism of its 286 students. 7 News reporter Colin Roos is live in the studio now to tell us why as the first notes of the year were drawn on the whiteboard. Colin. Catherine, the classrooms are set, the syllabus is made, and the bus routes are finalized. Wheeling Central Catholic says it's ready for a year of not just learning, but prayer and community service as well. The school goes back today along with Bel Air, Hancock County, Harrison Central, and several others. And it comes after an extra day of orientation for freshmen, helping them to find out who they can go to for help as they prepare to hit the books in high school. Principal Rebecca Sancombe says they're thrilled to see the Central family expand. We are excited that we have our largest enrollment that we've had in over 15 years here. So there's a lot of excitement around uh, that. And uh, we're so excited to welcome our newest class, the class of 2027, along with all of our returning students this year. I've learned a lot since freshman year. Freshman year was COVID, so it was a little bit different. But teachers have really taught us how to work in difficult times and just push through things and go out of our comfort zone. After spending her entire high school career as a Maroon Knight, she's looking forward to making more memories with the friends who have been along for the ride with her. Summer vacation still isn't over for the entire Ohio Valley. On Thursday, Buckeye Local, East Liverpool, Edison, and Shadyside, among others, will get on the bus for the first day of classes. Live in the 7 News studio, I'm Colin Roos, working for you. Colin, thanks.